The Boston Globe columnist who riled up the whole city before the game is backing down tonight. News Channel 5's John Kosick is at the queue, and John, he says that he never intended to put Cleveland down. Yeah, Danae, you know, to listen to Dan Shaughnessy, you think he worked for the Chamber of Commerce, but to read his words, not so much. I'm here to tell you I love Cleveland. I love Cleveland. And Boston Globe columnist Dan Shaughnessy did write that in today's column, followed, as they say, by a mighty big butt. The three-letter word that offers a literary license to then say what you really think. Shaughnessy called downtown Cleveland a sad space with many vacant buildings and boarded-up stores. It feels, he writes, like the local economy runs on lottery tickets. No hard feelings. Love you guys. Oh, the Horseshoe Casino crowd, he wrote, this is not Ocean's Eleven. It's more like Atlantic City on the Cuyahoga. This was not a bash job at all. It says in there, I love Cleveland. He loved East Fourth, apparently, but didn't write about the world class restaurants that line it, but rather the $3 PBRs you can get on its corner. It was a good thing writing about the $3 16 ounce Pabst Blue Ribbons. That's a good thing. That's not a shot. So, anyway, don't be so sensitive. You guys are better than that. Yes, we are, in his words, a godforsaken, hopeful town. We apparently have a problem seeing a compliment when we read one. Read it more carefully and realize that this is a friend, not a foe. This is somebody who has always rooted for Cleveland, rooting for him now, and uh, uh, no hard feelings. Love Cleveland. Well, showing us the ads that he expects Cleveland to take this series against Boston, and he will be rooting for them to end that 50-year championship drought that he was so happy to remind his Boston readers about. Reporting live at the queue, John Kosick, News Channel 5.